Hello and welcome everyone to this channel. My name is Kumar Saurabh and today in this video tutorial we will learn about Python dictionary count. We will explore a different methods to count the number of items in a dictionary. Specifically, we will cover four different approaches using a lane function, a for loop, list comprehension and the dict dot keys method. Let's dive right in. First method is the lane function. The lane function is a powerful tool in Python that allows us to determine the length of various objects. When applied to a dictionary, it returns the count of key value pairs or items in a dictionary. Here is the code. In this code, we have dictionary called cars that store different car brand as a keys and their corresponding values. By applying the lane function to the cars dictionary, we obtain the count of key value pairs. The output of print count is 4, indicating the number of car brands in dictionary. Another approach to counting items in a dictionary is by using a for loop. By treating over the keys of dictionary and incrementing the counter variable, we can keep track of number of keys or items in dictionary. Here is the code. In this code, we use a for loop to iterate over the keys of the car dictionary. With each iteration, the counter variable count is incremented. Ultimately, the final value of count represents the number of car brands or items in dictionary. The output of print count is 4, indicating the number of car brands in the dictionary. Now, move to the next approach, list comprehension. List comprehension provides an elegant and concise way to create a list from an iterable. We can utilize it to generate a list of keys from a dictionary and then determine its length using lane function. Here is the code. In this code, the list comprehension, car for car in cars, iterates over the keys of cars dictionary. The resulting list contains the keys and by applying the length function, we calculate its length. The output of print count is 4, indicating the number of car brands in the dictionary. Lastly, the dig.keys method provides a convenient way to access the keys of a dictionary. By applying the length function to the dig.keys object, we can determine the number of keys or items in the dictionary. Here is the code. In this code, cars.keys returns a view object containing the keys of the cars dictionary. By applying the lane function to this view object, we obtain the count of keys. The output of print count is 4, indicating the number of car brands in the dictionary. Before we end this tutorial, let me tell you that we have detailed post Python dictionary count using various methods on a website pythonguides.com. I hope that you have enjoyed video tutorial about Python dictionary count. So at last, I want to say don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and thank you.